all right guys for kage here and welcome back to the brand new video here we are again on street fighter duel and on today's video i want to show you uh, my daily routine while i will show you my daily routine i will giving you certain tips that will definitely help you progress through the, through the game so keep on watching i already done like when this game was released a daily routine so this will be like an updated version because it will be way more it will be way better because i know a lot more about the game than i did then okay so let me start first of all of course I, I i collect everything what's here claim all match predictions and who knows what okay what what is that oh yeah start guild fine um okay usually how i start i start with the daily missions like daily missions are essential guys because make sure to do this all the time especially now do all the dailies because with the activity points you're gonna be able to open these things and in that way you're gonna even unlock the free akuma summons and many more stuff so now the dailies are even more essential to do okay so let me start with that i will do it like extremely fast i will show you like my fastest method to do the dailies so let me start first i need to promote one character so let me just do this and promote boom fine just one time it's enough and then i will go and enhance my one of my equipments really quickly boom let me level up this one for example 1000 let's go okay boom that's about that okay so as you can see i already done this uh two things for the dailies okay the next thing let's go here let's collect collect this daily uh prizes i mean idle rewards uh let's use this because this is part of the daily mission and let me go immediately here and do one um story boom you can literally just enter and exit and it will count so i will do right that uh, there is no point of me fighting especially this one it's tough and i'm stuck a little bit here so you can literally just go in and leave and this will count as doing story boom so we, we're really close on finishing uh everything okay so let's do this really important to collect all the hearts from your friends draw a fighter like if you don't want to waste gems uh okay i can do a multi actually here so let's do it if you don't want to waste gems or tickets you can always do a friend recruit summon with the hearts you can literally do just a single summon and that's it i got shafted uh, <laughs> that's nothing new and by the way i forgot to do this now but make sure to share your multi if you do it because for the 50 gems like first multi of the day it gives you 50 gems if you share it i forgot but this 50 gems won't help me so much at this stage but then again definitely you should do this okay now we have the bounty mission to do let's just quick claim auto deploy let's go team quick and boom auto collect and that gg that's about bounty and then we have a few more stuff uh we have fight in arena so we can just generally do that let me choose some fight uh for example this one this is the theme this is the strategy that I, that i've been using uh that's not the main topic so let's um, not discuss about that i already have a videos with the team building tips for everything so go check it out okay victory boom nice and that's about the arena of course when i finish this video i will i will do more uh, arena fights and then guilt in shadowlands so also i need to go into my guilt claim this by the way row fighters you can see here on the left make sure to join there is eight more people uh eight more people can join you're all welcome just be active and we're good okay so go in a gold sh uh, guild shadow lands now uh oh this started perfect let me go into this one uh uh, which strategy i will take here uh let me go like this boom and be here okay and uh, i will take for example aoe heal aoe and bison aoe okay i'm not the best strategy for this but let's just do it uh for the dailies and everything else i'll just put it 
on auto four times again there is a better ways that i can deal more damage here i just need to play around but this will be just fine for now even and yeah i need to change ex move cards because i have s rank there so i will do more damage with that but fine let's just do this um on auto for now and then when we're done with this i believe we need to do the supreme fist and then the daily uh, dailies are done okay and then after i'm done with the dailies um i proceed to the shop and there i will tell you a few tips that are essential that will help you a lot to farm breakstones like breakstones is the rarest material in this game and this is crucial okay 18 million trash I, I could easily do 10 million more but okay i will play around with that um it's fine I, I i just put it on auto for now because that's not the main topic okay so again supreme fist you can generally enter I cannot beat this for now, so let, let me just leave for now, and boom, I believe this also counts, oh, challenge the supreme fist, okay, so this doesn't count, I need to actually fight, so whatever, let's fight then, I'll go with this for now, but yeah, we're gonna lose, like this one is really tough, I, I need to... Yep, yep. Okay. That was actually really good. Fine, whatever. Okay, we lost. Um, but like I said, I'm stuck here and in the challenges, unfortunately. Okay, boom. So I've done all the dailies. That's the first thing that I do. Uh, then we go into the shop. Now, this part is really, really important. Okay. Like, it's your choice. Do you want to buy Akuma tickets or not? Are they worth it? Well, not so much. Like, you need 10,000 for a multi. 10,000 gems, that's too much overall. Okay, but this is essential. Buy strengthening tokens, always if you can. Shattered crystal ball, always. But the breakstones are goddamn essential. Like, you want to buy every single breakstone that is available with both gems or money every day. Uh, everything else is like uh, this uh, it depends do you need the gear do you don't need the gear this is actually really worth it uh, for engraving the gears so you can go for that and also for example here after a while you will get an actual gear with the element this is a huge thing so mostly you want to buy gears with the element um, because like that you know you know precisely what you're buying okay and red gear red gear red gear okay that always focus on red gear okay uh also in this shop buy whatever you need like it, it really doesn't matter but focus on a great fragments of course here jewelry 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 and then we have honor shop rose 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 but then again if you need something else go for it buy it right it's really your choice but this one is essential look at this what you can do you can generally use 100 gems for a reset and that is crucial for farming breakstones restart with your gems the shop and get those breakstones this is essential restart it for a few times if needed because you will need those uh breakstones like i need overall 300k uh, breakstones to fully build up certain stuff so it will take a while but this is definitely worth it to do okay this is like one of the biggest tips that i can give you now do it two times for 100 gems and then 200 gems it depends uh, do you think that you can do it do it or not like in my eyes it's definitely worth it it's better than i just spend the gems on some kind of summons and get shafted this one gives me for 100 percent breakstone like crazy amount of breakstones by restarting um so i would advise restart it like as much as you want it depends how much gems do you have but i'm telling you getting those breakstones you will need it again i repeat so this is 100 worth it but also yeah you spend a lot of money here so it just depends on your account and situation but in my situation definitely i need to max out the amount of breakstones i can get like if i go here into promote 
go here into promote i need like what now i'm at 24k i need 50k and then i need 50 another 50k for this another another 50k and another 50k etc etc so i need bunch of breakstones okay so that is the mainly thing that i always do after the dailies okay the next thing is of course in arena play battle royale play super showdown that is something that i always do correct guess let's go let me see prediction yeah he will win like just by his mm, let's see the details he has completely maxed out Kum akuma he has he doesn't have but just because of dragon can i will go for this like dragon can is or maybe this like more people are in for this but i'm not sure bro i'm not sure oh he has gormagala can and jen and oh yeah 100 yeah, yeah i didn't notice gormagala can sorry 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 yeah this team is the way to go so anyways always do all of that play super showdown do this do that i don't need to repeat that and then in the explore of course shuttle o city is essential like every time you have it available do it supreme fist we already checked that one out and then global operation when i'm done with everything then i go a little bit in the verse world or try grounds and do what i have left okay so that's about that uh of course i collect all the perks daily offers boom ex move back and that's pretty much that okay and now what we have left is to buff certain things like for example this one mainly i'll focus now on this and assassins uh ex move okay from the okay i can buff this part this is actually really good let me just do it really quickly upgrade okay awaken dojo of course you need to do this every day visit dojo collect the prizes enhance um, unlock things in dojo and then work on it is definitely worth it because over time you will get some crazy materials that only end game whale players know for now okay look at how much materials i have overall which is like really 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 good okay but still break stone break stones break stones okay uh let's check out this secret training uh this is the something new here and you have like attempts remaining two times per day you can play precision training or memory training okay i advise you that you play like one um pre uh, precision training gives you better rewards if i remember correctly so maybe you should be more focused on this one and then memory training for fun but like do do one memory training and then do one precision training why not okay so that's about that and then what is left for me to do is oh for example i didn't do a summon right here so of course destiny tarot really essential yeah by the end when i'm done with everything and with the dailies and then i go into the events okay then i do daily tarot and everything connected with that and also we're gonna go now into event and that's pretty much it that is my daily routine and this you should be doing this like every single day if you want to progress especially as a free-to-play so nightmare like usually it depends what it depends currently now we have akuma event live so i go into temple lamp i check out how much of those materials i have I already made a guide on my 40 minutes long video or something else what you should buy so i won't repeat myself but then again i see now okay i cannot still buy uh, the most important material which is this one then i'll just keep on saving those materials master gift of course you you open this up uh oh let's go um this like like i said doing every single daily is essential because you get those activity points and with that you, with that you're gonna get a bunch of prizes from here from the break stones tickets akuma tickets and everything else okay cycle of fate we cannot do this yet special summon i have seven tickets but i'll just save it i won't summon for now i'm tired of the summons and of course then i play jashura trial and that's pretty much it from my daily routine um i don't need like okay we have okay okay today we we can fight against ken 
and get additional buffs and so first i will play ken today okay we're gonna finish this five times and then i'll be focused on akuma challenge and that's pretty much it guys hopefully you did enjoy it i said few uh tips the biggest tips is for the shop uh, about the breakstones so be focused on that but then again be careful with your materials it, it all depends what kind of account you have but that's it hopefully you did enjoy the video leave a like subscribe uh, like i was thinking should i do this or not but then again a lot of you asked me a few things so i also answered that on today's video in that way and just show you overall my daily routine that should be definitely helpful for you to progress okay that's that love ya and bye